twisted We don't care about feelings, this shit up about business All I see is commas, 20, 50, 100, racing to the money We lost somebody real special Rest in peace, Juice World. Yeah, rest in peace to Juice World. It's it's crazy. Um, I don't know. I feel like it's like I ain't even know how how to make this video. It's just crazy because it's like I feel like you know connected to Juice like in the in a different kind of way. He, he from where I'm from. You right. Hear me? He from Chicago, and it's like damn, he was he was great at what he did. You feel me? He was a dope ass musician. You feel me? Nigga was the freestyle king for real, for real, like going crazy. But I don't know. It's just uh, I'm sad in a different type of way, though. I don't know. It's yeah. Just crazy. Um, I guess I feel you. Like I, I, I feel the same way too. And I think that um something that I wanted to say that's so important is that people connect with people like on different levels. Some people connect with people for their music. Some people connect with people for like you know the personal things because like now we got social media, so we get to spend more time with the artists like yeah. and see their lives more. And sometimes they may even comment back. You know what I'm saying? You actually can get that interaction with and them feel now. like you really know them. Like right. You know. and and like um as I said, like with him being from Chicago, it's always really like it's super hard when it like when a death is like, you know, from somebody from your city. And then especially when they somebody that blow up, you really just rooting for them. I don't know. It's just so crazy. Like I, I really feel like it's shocking. Yeah. It don't feel real to me right now. It does it just don't feel it's like real. Even it seems one day later, like this is the next day, you feel me? And it still don't feel real, like Juice World is really gone. Yeah, it just don't it don't feel real. And then it's like the stories that's like it's more stories coming out about it now. Yeah. Like they saying, Oh, uh seventy pounds of woo 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 was found in this suitcase. It's like I don't know, it's just like crazy. And then they saying that he was popping, you know several people right and not before he um had a seizure it's like whoa it's whoa, just so whoa, many stories it's like what what kind of puzzled me too is like everything i was seeing just as a collective i was the post i was seeing the media i'm talking about even the popular media videos everything was just kind of like outrageous to me it was like rest in peace but it's like and i guess it's cool how everybody want to deal with death you know what i'm saying like death is how you want to deal with it but i you know at first i thought it was kind of like a standard you know we saying rest in peace but it's like yeah we be over here well not we but y'all <laughs> be like keeping up this like it's like okay he died we don't know why he died yet we, he had a seizure and i feel like the first thing that everything said was oh drug, drugs drug, 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 that's why y'all gotta yeah. stop doing them drugs it's man. like it's like and i get it i get it though it's okay he rapped about it okay he could have just been, you feel me, rapping about it. Just like Future said, he was only rapping about lean, but he wasn't really drinking lean. Didn't you he say that? Me? Just like a lot of rappers get exposed for not really being about what that they rap about. And not even to yeah. say it, like he not about that, but it just, I mean, in comparison with the lean thing. Like, you rap about it. It's all like in all. everybody was, tr like, equating it to some so, like, negative. Trying land. to send a message. You know? Trying it's to like, send a message. And I get it. You do want to send a message. But I feel like, leave that up to his own, his people to send that message. You feel me? Leave that up to yeah. her to send that message. His you, his family, family if they right. want to send a message. Mm -hmm. I feel like you, the, the general public, always decide what, what they want to do with the deaths now. And that's cool because everything is on social media. You got your opinions. But it is kind of like, if they, if it's just like with car accidents and people who be texting and driving and somebody die, if they finally decide to speak out and use that as an example to make people aware, that's their choice. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's kind of like rude for us to make all of these assumptions and stuff. You know, we don't know if that's really how he died or whatever. Y'all just like, saying that. You don't that. know if that's like a history in his family, like that people Anything. has. Or, you know what I'm saying? It's like, so yeah, I, I agree with you that like they shouldn't uh, just equated it to you know that that you like really just know. let him rest in peace and then when we hear about it we hear about it whatever and then once you get the facts then you can fully give it why and then I I feel like another thing with this I don't want to dwell on it too much but it's like we got to stop using death as a means to send a message because it's like death is not really the end you know what i'm saying it's but as far of, as y'all thinking no it's the end yeah, right it's, it's a like new beginning for you know for some it's for like some, you right know, you're transcending 
onto a, a higher, you know what I'm saying, being. But you want people to, you know, have a fulfilling life, so send messages to them before it even gets to that. Get on here and talk about stop doing drugs and all of that before that. Make those posts and those comments before it even gets to that. Like, I don't know. I guess it's just weird. And then I think um, another thing I kind of wanted to say with that because this is important to me. The fact that I feel like if you're going to send a message, send it the right way. And I want to send that message the right way. Yes, I don't want y'all to do drugs. I don't want y'all to take pills because these pills are not good for y'all. Whether they're street drugs or they're prescription drugs, actually, yeah. it's not good for you to be taking it. I want to send a message that stop doing those drugs, but also get the help that you need so that you can dig deep and really find out what it is that has you even looking for these drugs because that's what y'all not addressing when y'all telling people, stop yeah. doing these drugs. You feel me? Yeah. You can't just walk up to somebody on the street. We were talking about this earlier mm -hmm. and tell them, hey, hey, you stop doing them drugs you don't know what they've been through they, oh they're not gonna just say oh okay i'm gonna stop doing these drugs because they bad and i don't know what's in them and they fake no they're gonna do them because it make it it erase the pain so we need to get down to the bottom of where is this pain coming like, from what happened to you exactly. let's heal that let's get to that and I, I think that's like nobody has said that everybody's like just stop doing them drugs man because it sound good or you know I, it's just it's irritating that's not that's not the solution to the problem it's deeper than that. Yeah. So, I, I, I don't know. I just wanted to say that. And I feel like just really let him rest in peace. It's like all this other shit coming out. Okay, yeah, I know all about the weed stuff. I don't care about all that. Ooh, that yeah. shit bogus. It's bogus. I don't want nobody to go down for that. It's like we need to just let this go. I hope it. I hope this just... Everybody just can be good on this. For real. It's yeah. tragic. I, I just feel like, I don't know. Juice was a real nigga, man. He was a real Chicago nigga to me. Like his whole personality, his persona... When he first came out, I was like, damn, like, you feel me? He going crazy, like, he was just a real Chicago nigga to me, man. And yeah. it's just fucked up that we lost a real one, you feel me? Because seeing him his, on his lives and all of that, like, he was yeah. a real knowledgeable dude. And that's how like, I connect with people now for some reason. It's like, I do connect with their music. I be knowing their songs, you know, especially, like, their hits and stuff. But I be watching people live, their videos, and, you know, I be really trying to get into the personal with people. So, I'm that's where I be at with it. Yeah. And I, I just feel like with that, too, people just got to stop thinking that. You got to listen to all of their music and all of that and know every word. It's like right. people connect with people on different, different levels. Different levels, exactly. Yeah, man, that shit crazy, man. Rest in peace, Juice. Man, yeah, he man. was so young. It's like, I just hate 21. it. 21, yeah. I just hate it happening. Live your life to the fullest. That's what I want to say. And I, I can't say he did do that. That's like, what I'm he, was he was teased every living. day. Even like the last two posts on his Instagram were super lit. Like, you know what I'm saying? It was like the one when he like standing on the boat like this that. and then it was another Damn. one when he like he had a thriller and he was just it was his birthday post I think and he just had the thriller and he was turning he was up. turning up. It and was like damn. And I was it's crazy cuz I seen like both of them posts like I was watching it like I don't know. And that's crazy. what I wanted to know too. It's, it's like that's what I'm saying. It's just so much controversy every time somebody down. Oh, they comparing the deaths now to so and so right. when uh, he was so unhappy and you can you hear it. And he right. was it in the you don't know what and, how he was feeling because, like he said, he even had turned up on his fans one time because they was like, "Oh yeah." When as soon as Juice World got a new girlfriend, they was like, "Oh yeah, I can't wait until he break up with her so we could get some more sad songs." Yeah, and he was it. like, "Wait, hold up, man." Don't get get the get off that like y'all acting weird right now like real weird like y'all so goofy. That's an indication like, that you he know. like man I could be happy and still make sad songs. You feel me? I could be sad and make a happy song. It don't matter how I'm feeling. I could still make this whatever song y'all wanna. You feel me? feel or want at the moment right he was like don't don't try to ruin like what i got going because i'm you feel me I'm, I'm in a good space right now he was happy with his girl or whatever you know what i'm saying so it's oh, like no. just, it's like the speculation just gotta stop. stop if you exactly. really want, so I just feel like the true definition is letting rest in peace. It's like rest in peace. You know what I'm saying? And keep their name alive in good spirits. Spend them tracks or whatever. You feel yeah. me? So so his peoples can still eat. You know and what I'm saying? Look out for him that type of way. It's some, like 
Some people were saying he wasn't a legend and all. It's like, what? Like, Juice is a fucking legend, bro. Aww, stop shit. playing. Like, so, nigga went number one. Like, stop playing. So like, that's you what you know think. What I'm I don't saying? really, you he, know what? He had great accomplishments. So, in my eyes, Juice World is a legend. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I, I did see know. a lot of y'all was kind of like, you know, y'all was going back and forth in the comments about that. Juice a legend, man. He so, a fucking rock star. Stop tell me what y'all think about him, that man. legend stuff. Like, what know, do y'all think man. Juice World is considered? Considered a legend. I know y'all was saying he said he didn't want to be considered a legend. He said, but that's right now, you know. It's like right, that was in the that moment. Was right that, that was, was in, in the moment. moment. You know what I'm saying and, and what he was speaking on. Right. But I feel I don't know. He said he ain't want to die young. He said something about all the legends die young. What the fuck is this about? I'm trying to make it out. Like you hear me? But it was like he he died young. He is a legend. Like you hear me? At the same time, like I don't know. All it's, the legends do die young, y'all. It's not a lie. It's not a lie. You know. I don't know what it is, but it's not a lie. I swear. It's like I can name so many people right now. I feel like even people that that like Michael Jackson, um, so Whitney many. Houston, yeah. like they was young. Like I know y'all may think like forties and stuff is not young, but that that's kind of young. Like yeah. So I don't know. Let us know, man. Uh, rest in peace. Like we just wanted to post this video to show, like you know, we 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 um we really did, like. Yeah, we just wanted to send our condolences to Juice World's family and friends, and then you know his fans and everybody and G Herbo and you know. Yeah. Got it twisted. We don't care about feelings. This shit about business. All I see is commas twenty fifth and hundred racing to the money.